Hi and welcome back to the next video and in this video we will continue looking at building up the KPIs which count the number of work orders that are waiting at each of the different status codes and the next one is going to be work orders waiting for spares so let's go back into our presentation and this one is really straightforward number of work orders waiting spares delivery for greater than 30 days so the Currently, the number of work orders at W Martel status for greater than 30 days. So let's go back into here and we're going to add a new calculated column. And in here, we're going to call this one work orders. I will just actually, yeah, work orders. Work orders waiting. Spears greater than 30 days. This is going to be really straightforward. We're going to look at if, which is a simple if statement, and we're going to put status, work order status. In fact, we need an and statement in here if and work order status equals wmartel and the second and is going to be days at current status is greater than 30 then 1 otherwise 0 And then we'll just put an end to that if statement. So that's a fairly straightforward calculated column. And then we're going to add in a new measure. And this measure is going to count those. So again, it's a pretty straightforward measure. Uh, work order. Waiting. Spares greater than 30 days count equals and then we say calculate and the expression is going to be count rows exactly the same as before work order variable table and the filter that we're going to apply here is going to be the work orders waiting materials for greater than 30 days which is this one waiting spares equals one and then we'll just close that down and then we can add this into our table it is here brilliant and we start to build up a table here and we'll add it in as a card as well so let's copy this one here and then we'll add in this measure, this measure here. So we've got 91 of these. Okay, work orders with materials. So we've got, the total we've got here is 197, but 91 of them are work orders that have been waiting for spares for getting 30 days. So these are things we need to follow up on and find out what, what's happening with these. Some may have a delivery, um, a longer delivery window and a longer lead time. But most most things should be getting delivered, particularly um, particularly if it's 167. Most things should be delivered within within 30 days. So we can chase up on those and push them forward in the process and get work flowing through the system. Okay, so thanks for listening, and we will cover the next status in the next video.